Hello everyone. Uh, so in this video, I'm going to cover Tipco PW Container Edition uh, to 10 getting started on Cloud Foundry. So we will learn how to create a sample REST application using uh, Tipco PW Container Edition to 10 and then uh, test that application on that studio. And finally, we will going to push it on uh, my Cloud Foundry instance. And we have to make sure before pushing the app, we would also need to push the Tipco BW Container Edition to one or build back on Cloud Foundry. Okay, so the prerequisites are you have to download a uh, Tipco BWC Studio from a delivery and uh, also the build pack from Cloud Foundry. I'll show you that link uh, in a in a while. And also you need a CLI for Cloud Foundry. So here uh, you can see I'm uh, you know showing you the the link where you can download the studio and uh, on on the same link you can go and uh, download you know uh, build back okay so i already have the studio installed uh, i will just click on the exe and uh, open my workspace for uh, container edition so i will going to uh, create a very simple hello world rest uh, application so I'll uh, click on a uh, new business uh, works application module and uh, write sample rest application and click on finish. So, so I'll click on uh, create rest service. I'll just uh, keep everything as default switch from post to a get service because I just need a hello world. Click on finish. Okay. Now I'll click on uh, the get call and in the input tab, I will just uh, go and type hello BWC uh, for the response. So it's a hard coded response, and when I hit this rest service, I should see this. So let's quickly go and configure my. Uh, the run configuration and I'll just make it run so you can see the application is getting started and uh, I'll just use the OSGI command which is L endpoints which will give me the endpoints for this for this service so I'll use that endpoint and hit that in browser and yes you can see the response which is hello bwc so by default studio platform settings are for cloud foundry you can go to windows preferences and see container platform as cloud foundry now let's export this same application in my local folder and i'll make it uh, push on cloud foundry instance assuming that my cloud foundry is up and running and uh, for that, uh, I just need to use these are the some uh, Cloud Foundry commands. You can uh, log into your Cloud Foundry instance using CF login, and you can also push your build pack using CF create build pack command. So I already have pushed it and using CF build packs to fetch the list of build packs. Okay, so you can see these are the list of build packs. Uh, some of them are my own build pack. So I will use my own build pack. So let's log into Cloud Foundry instance and uh, i will do cf push so this is the cf push my application name is my awesome app and the er and the build pack name so it is pushing the application of cloud foundry you can see my awesome app here uh, it's still in red it's taking time to get pushed you can see the logs here so you can see it is now pushed and I will just open that application. Here you go. So you can see the application is pushed on Cloud Foundry. So this concludes my uh, video. For any queries, you can visit Tech Community. Thank you.